conquerors. Romans chapter 8, verses 35 to 39. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall tribulation or distress or persecution or famine or nakedness or peril or sword? As it is written, for your sake we are killed all day long. We are accounted as sheep for the slaughter. Yet in all these things we are more than conquerors through him who loved us. For I am persuaded that neither death nor life, nor angels nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come, nor height nor depth, nor any other created thing shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. The Apostle Paul mentions all kinds of challenges. He talks about tribulation, that is, hardships, distresses, persecution, which is opposition from people, uh, and difficult situations like famine, and nakedness, and peril, and sword. He says, you know, all kinds of things, especially because we are believers, we are God's people. We are accounted all day long like sheep for the slaughter. So all these things come against us. But then he says, you know, in the midst of all these things, we are more than conquerors because of the one who loved us. And then he says, nothing, nothing can separate us from the love that God has for us in Christ. Now think about this. All these things come against us. They try to rob us of our faith. They try to put us down. They try to uh, get us to give up on our God. But Paul says, you know, we just stand our ground. And God's love for us is unbreakable. Nothing can separate us from the love that God has for us. And so he says, you know, in all of these things, we are more than conquerors. And I want you to get, a, get that in your heart. You are more than a conqueror. That you can actually laugh and you can actually smile and you can actually uh, have joy in your heart in the midst of all the adversities because you are more than a conqueror. And God is going to cause you to triumph. The love that God has for you is unbreakable. You are inseparable from the love that God has for you. Nothing can shake it. Nothing can break it. No matter how harsh the situations might be, God still loves you. So that because of that love, it says you, you are more than a conqueror. You come out victorious. God will bring you through into a place of victory. So I have that spirit of a conqueror inside you. Say and affirm in every situation, you are more than a conqueror through him who loved you. Don't feel like you are a victim. Don't feel like you are put down. Don't feel like you are abandoned. No, you're never abandoned. You are more than a conqueror. You may be pressed on every side, but you're not hopeless. You may be knocked down, but you're not given up. Has knocked out. God will get you back on your feet and He will cause you to win. Have that in your heart. You are more than a conqueror. Let's pray. Father, I pray even now for everyone listening that it will grip our hearts, God, that we are more than conquerors in every situation to the one who loved us, Jesus Christ. And Father, I pray that even now you will cause each one to walk in victory, that your empowering grace will cause them to overcome, that God, with faith in our hearts, they will walk victorious because you always cause us to triumph in Christ. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.